Now to those eye-opening comments made just moments ago from Russian President Vladimir Putin, and we want to get right to ABC's Martha Raditz, tracking that from Washington this morning. Martha, good morning. Good morning, David. Putin appeared at an economic summit in St. Petersburg, Russia, saying what we see now is full-scale civil war in Ukraine. This, of course, comes in advance of Ukraine's elections this weekend, where a new president will be chosen. The front runner, a billionaire, already saying he does not think Russia will accept the results. Violence is of grave concern during the elections. Yesterday, more than a dozen Ukrainian troops were killed at a checkpoint pro-Russian militants claiming credit for that attack, David. And Martha, we know U.S. intelligence tracking Russian troops on the border. What do we know about that this morning? Any movement? Well, of course, tens of thousands of Russian troops remain on the border with Ukraine. The U.S. says they have seen some of those troops move away from the border, as Vladimir Putin has promised. But the U.S. still says this is a force capable of moving into Ukraine and considers the troop presence very threatening, David. All right, Martha Raddatz this morning tracking it all. Martha, thanks. And by the way, you can see Martha first thing in the morning on Sunday. ABC's This Week with George with Martha filling in.